Hello there, my name is Yolita Brilliant, and today I'll be sharing um, my experience with um, how to improve your wellness. Um, I also own Brilliant Massage and Skin in Burlington and South Burlington, Vermont, and uh, this particular video is how to improve your wellness through genetic testing. Um, my both parents passed away when they were young actually they were 41 years old um, and after that i really got interested into how to prevent disease not how to treat when it's too late but how to prevent um, and as much as possible there's things we cannot of course prevent you know it's impossible to do that but we can at least minimize the risks as much as possible so I did genetic testing at the uh, Vermont um, University of Vermont Medical Center uh, a while back for g uh, cancer gene testing, which came back negative um, because of my mother's side. My mom died from cancer, but um, she had, um, I think she had pylorus, that's what caused her cancer the bacteria, which probably could have been treated um, and, uh, you know, with some changes, probably the cancer could have been prevented, some lifestyle changes too. Um, however, uh, my parent died from con con congenital heart is issue and a addiction issue, kind of mixed all together. Um, he was a successful person. Uh, but he had a uh, vulnerability and you know so I did this um, gene test through 10x because I attended 10x growth conference and I'm like okay let me try this it was $5.99 um, I know that there has to be there most likely is other gene you know like nutritional enzyme it like these the that gene test is not like a cancer test that I did before. This is for um how your body metabolizes different enzymes. Like so they tested for five I don't know, I've seen online, I watched some YouTube videos, seem like other people had like a wider list, but these are maybe main ones for you know optimal uh like absorption and methylation product production i don't know not medical doctors so don't quote me on the medical terms uh i am a massage therapist and a licensed esthetician licensed massage therapist and esthetician but we don't really study enzymes you know that stuff in that like a uh, medical doctor that studies this they would know better so you know always of course consult with your doctor if this is something could be helpful. Um, I just went out and done it because like I'm very passionate about it. So um, the, the the five main genes that they tested, MTHFR, MTR, which both for me came back as green so that I suppose I didn't inherit any break in that gene from neither of my parents. MTRR gene, however, I um, inherited break from both of my parents. Um, so, and they uh, gave, gave me here, you know, what supplements I could take to su supplement that vulnerability, you know, that my body doesn't maybe, um, you know, there are other systems that can compensate for that vulnerability in the body, but, you know, in times of high stress, distress, illness, that might be my bad spot, you know, but it also says, you know, it affects your mind. This affects not just your body, but your mind. So, for example, um, MTHFR gene, um, both parents, um, it um, says you could have, like, anxiety. Oh, no, sorry, not this one. I don't have anxiety. MTR not MTHFR. Yeah, so it says you could have heartburn and acid reflux. And I'll get to anxiety later. That was a different one. But, um, you know, like, but I don't, I don't know if I do. I think I've had on occasion that. Uh, but so it says tend to have short temper and 
punishment sometimes doesn't meet the crime and the reaction of people with this break. I don't know. I think when I was younger, that was more like the case. I think I've gotten much more controlled and stabilized. I never blow up on people. But I now that I think, you know, I did have cut people unties off sometimes. Uh, maybe perhaps other person would think it wasn't that big of a deal. But that is in our genes. You know, our personality can form around our genes. Um, so... What else does it say? I think this one is the one, you know, the t uh, thyroid could have thyroid issues, perhaps. Everything to do with, like the upper gut. So, and then the next gene that they test, H A H C Y, which is normal. Now, the last gene, like at the end of that chain, was C O M T, COM T gene, I guess you would call it. Um, which can, you know, if you are, if you don't have this, so I inherited half, so I'm half a break. So kind of in the middle, not bad, not like, um, not overreactive, like people that don't have the bleed, uh, the break, they have very reactive this. But, you know, it could be beneficial, actually, like being in the middle on, on this cone T gene, because what it says is, wow, you know, I could be experiencing ADD, ADHD, OCD, racing thoughts, poor sleep, have short temper, uh, but, you know, high blood pressure, hormone regulation. But I can be organized and I can be um, type A personality, uh, self-driven because um, that even says tend to be like entrepreneurs, don't take direction well from others. I agree on, well, I used to take very good direction at school. I was a straight A student when I wanted to. Um, but I did not like it. That's why I decided, you know, this sucks. I need to go to business for myself. And I like to kind of make decisions, be in control sort of thing. Um, and I would agree sometimes I have symptoms, ADHD, where I sometimes interrupt people because, oh, I'm going to forget that thought. Not because I'm trying to be rude, but like I want to get that thought out. And it's like almost I have so many thoughts that... If I don't say it now, I'm not going to remember what that thought was. Um, so that could be, you know, the effect of that gene break. Um, and I assume people that have both inherited this from this break from their parents is have even more extreme, you know, symptoms. But we can clean those up with the right supplementation, you know, the right diet if we eat high nutritious foods. For me, for example, vitamin B12 is extremely important. Zinc, um, like uh, riboflavin, um, let's see, let's go up here to the top. So yeah, so this advised uh, me to supplement with L-methionine, B-complex, magnesium, and zinc, because magnesium calms you down. The other thing, it says do not drink green tea. Uh, or because it has that HCs, um, CCs thing in it, which actually I love green tea, but now I switch more to other teas. Also, stop drinking coffee. I just feel better, less anxiety. And now that I see, you know, it actually with my gene, I should not be drinking because I'm already amped up, you know, I'm driven. So when I'm on coffee, I'm like on steroids and I just like get all anxious. And so like... I'm without coffee, like like other people with coffee, and even I've gotten compliments, like, well, not compliments, like, I guess things like, oh, you have so much energy, like, how much coffee did you have? I'm like, I had zero coffee. I had literally no caffeine. Um, it might appear like I had, you know, because um, of that energy and drive sometimes, and, um, but... You know, there's different types of supplements and qualities, so they recommend, you know, a specific type. And I watched some other um, doctor actually talk about the vitamin B12, some forms of, like, methylcobalamin that they recommend, or they say hydroxycobalamin. 
hydroxycobalamin actually is better with people that have also calm teeth break. That's what I've heard from a doctor um, because the methylcobalamin can make you angry. People with certain uh, other genes and I noticed that I took that methylcobalamin and I'm like why am I so angry today and I'm like made sense that supplement you know so you gotta kind of look in all these um, things because I'm not an angry person so and then L-methionine so I ordered they're on the way um I hope that they're packaging them like there's not much information on the supplements where they source them or anything so I usually have you know I buy the highest quality supplements I can find for example like Garden of Life I trust um, um, there's a couple other brands like Pure Energy um, and so the other thing with the mind break genes, like detoxification could be an issue. And that's why they like, maybe just for me or I don't know for everyone, they focus, you know, eating healthy diet, especially like leafy greens, fish, um, organic stuff, which I gravitate already to. And I switch more to it even recently now again. Um, I used to do all organic best and I stopped doing it down gonna try to do it again uh, I feel better on that because with my gene break in Tripoli I kind of knew you know um, my body can have sometimes an issue of detoxing all that stuff that's additives pesticides all that stuff um, so you know it's good to know um, and people that have these gene breaks and not having adequate nutrition also or like for example if they can't um, process B12 properly so they're maybe processing a small amount and they're not even getting enough of it so then they're really out of it so that's why it's important to add more of those things that you can like process as well because then that's where could illness come you know and mental issues anxiety, stress, um, you won't be able to process, you know, you just process your daily tasks as good, you might be tired, and um, yeah, so I recommend, you know, anyone that's interested to know more about themselves, I also did 23andMe several years ago, and then I signed up for this other thing through, um, uh, through the, I uh, forgot what's the name was of that one, but it's like they you they can use 23andMe results, um, and they, um, let's see, I think it's like food, gene, actually I have an app on it, um, Dino Palette, so they um, take the raw data, and then they actually create a special meal menus for you. It's very cool. Um, I'll try to see if I can link down below to any of this stuff. I don't know. It might be affiliates, might be not. Um, but um, I will try to put those down below. If you have any questions, put them in the comments as well. So, see, they have the supplements that they can um, also create for you. Let's see haven't even checked this but meal timing well this wow this cool stuff here well maybe I'll make an updated video once I start you know taking more of these recommended supplements if I see even more no notice any difference anyway thank you for watching me ramble here for like 14 minutes I guess Hopefully you found this helpful, but really check this out because you might have a gene break, you not know it, and you wonder why you have anxiety. Maybe you should not be drinking tea, you know, that eat cakes, you cheat stuff. Maybe caffeine in general is not good. Or maybe you should not be eating uh, certain, you know, foods, like you can't process them. Um, or you need certain uh, additional things to eat. Alright, well, I'll see you next time and stay healthy and wealthy and if you need a massage, make your life better, skincare services, come see us in Burlington downtown, South Burlington, 
uh, Vermont as well, close by the airport. Uh, we offer a variety of services, teeth whitening, hydrofacial too, we have, and fun stuff, waxing. So, couples and flash, check it out, have a brilliant day.